हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन टू माय चैनल अस्मास बॉटनी ओके टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द न्यू टॉपिक दैट इज द को डोमिनेंस ओके को डोमिनेंस ओके सो यू नो द टर्म को को मीन्स टुगेदर विथ टुगेदर विथ समन अगर ओके सो एंड यू नो आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द टाइप्स ऑफ इंट्राजीनिक टाइप जीन इंट्रैक्शन एंड इंटरजीनिक टाइप जीन इंट्रैक्शन सो इट इज द इंट्राजीनिक टाइप जीन इंट्रैक्शन मीन्स इट इज बिटवीन द टू एलिज ऑफ अ सिंगल जीन ओके सो इट इज द को डोमिनेंस ओके सो वट इट सेज इट सेज दैट द डेफिनेशन इज इन दिस टाइप ऑफ जीन इंटरैक्शन Dominant allele and recessive allele both. So dominant and recessive both the alleles independently express itself. Okay. So because of the effect of these both alleles in F1 generation in heterozygous condition, the phenotype which is developed, which is different from both of the parents. Okay. so we can understand this definition by the example by this example that is the skin skin coat color in the cattle okay so skin coat color cattle gene have the two contrasting form alleles first is the red color allele which is capital r and white color allele which is a small r This capital R is dominant and small R is recessive. Okay, and when when the these both alleles are present in together in the heterozygous condition, then it shows the co-dominance. And what is the co-dominance? Co-dominance means it produces the ron ron coat color. What is the ron? Ron means this. in this you can see this example this picture shows the ron color means this red color red color means this red color is present okay and the white white color white color is also present here so in the ron this skin coat color the cattle have some hair which have the red color and some hair which are white in color so these two hair colors not mix in each other mix in each other means it is not in complete dominance the hairs are not pink like in complete dominance okay uh, in that the flowers were taken so the flowers uh, are not pink here the, the hairs are not pink not mix of this red and white it is not in complete dominance and it is also not the complete dominance it is also not the complete dominance because this red color allele cannot completely mask the expression of this recessive uh, white color allele so the hair color of the cattle is not red some hairs in the cattle body surface are red or but some patches of this white color hairs are also present so they so the definition what the definition says definition says the dominant allele the red color allele and recessive allele both the alleles independently express itself means they are independent they do not mix in each other like in complete dominance okay so the, this red color expresses itself and white color also expresses itself okay and because of this effect of this both the alleles in f1 generation in heterozygous condition the ron means some some hairs are red and some hairs are white ron phenotype tells which is different from both of the parents which is not this which is different means which is uh, present in the parents but not exactly means some part come from the one parent and some part from the another parent both the alleles expresses independently okay so this is and 
the cross is when we took this parents. Uh, these must be homozygous. Okay. And uh, this homozygous. You know the homozygous. And first is red and, uh, and second is white color. Helpless. Then from the gametes and after in fecundation you see you will see the wrong phenotype develop. Okay, this means this red color animal expresses itself completely or independently, and this white color animal also expresses itself independently. Then after do we will we will do the selfing. Selfing, you notice know you know the selfing, you know. And uh, after this, uh, from the gametes for the F2 generation, then after the formation of the checker port, you will see the phenotypic ratio of the F2 generation is the deviate from the 3 to 1. In compared to the Mendel's monohybrid cross phenotype. Okay. So here it is 1 is to 2 is to 1, not 3 is to 1. So this is because of the co-dominance. This is a type gene interaction. Okay. So but genotype is same. Genotype is same. But it is different. Okay. Okay. So this is the second example of the coat dominance. First is the skin coat color in the cattle. Second is the blood group inheritance in humans. Okay. So blood group inheritance in humans in this gene for the blood group gene for the blood group that is the gene i has the three alleles okay so g's this gene i has the three alleles i a i b i o okay so these are the three alleles for a single gene so this process is known as the multiple allelism because there are more than two alleles for a single genes okay I have told you that uh, there are two edges for a single gene, but here there are three edges for a single gene. So how so how can this possible? So it is possible only when this edges are present in a population. So what is the definition of this multiple allelism? Multiple allelism means multiple alleles means more than two edges are present, which are from one gene that are responsible for a single trait here the trait is the blood group inheritance but in the population but in one human being or the in one person if you talk about that in one person there are two alleles of a single gene okay but in population three alleles means in in one person either a b can present or b o can present any two can be present only but in population three alleles are present so this process is known as the multiple allelism okay then here this i a and i b are co-dominant over each other means if i a and i b are present together then both the alleles expresses itself independently so the blood group type is a b type not a not b not the mix of these two it is a b then a b when i a and i b are completely dominant over i o if i a is present with i o then the blood group type is i a because it is dominant the i a is dominant and i b present with i o then the blood group type is also i b because it is dominant over i o okay this is the table in this the four types of blood groups are present in the phenotype A, B, A, B, and O. And here, these are the antigens that are present on the RBC. You, you, uh, you know that on the surface of the red blood cells, sugar polymers are present. And these sugar polymers are known as antigens. And uh, this antigen A is the and acetyl galactosamine type sugar polymer and anti antigen B is the galactose type sugar polymer, polymer and AB have the both antigen A and B but O have no antigen okay but and what is the antibody for blood group A B antibody is present B blood group A one antibody is present and AB blood group have no antibody and O blood group have A and B antibody. 
okay bodies okay then the gen genotype is of six types okay so this a blood group can form two types of genotype either the both the alleles i a and i a come in the genotype and also this i a dominant allele come with i o recessive type so this both possibilities are there and b can also form two these two and and this o can only form when this genotype both the alleles are of i o type then this is possible okay so and i a do the synthesis of anti so i have already discussed then if we can understand we can know the genotype of the children of the offspring by the cross of this if we know the parents blood group genotype we can know how can so if if you take the example when two parents from which one have one have the a blood group and second have the b blood group so four possibilities are there to for the crossing and the offspring genotype is what we can know so this first is the when dominant dominant come this heterozygous this uh, one is homozygous second is heterozygous and this one is heterozygous and another is homozygous come okay okay so there are four possibilities for the uh, offsprings or progenies formation okay uh, from which only one we will discuss okay because and you can also form the checkerboard uh, for this three other types and these three types also shows the co dominance with some in in with some complete dominance and co dominance but the first type is easier to un understand the main topic the co dominance so i will show you this so what is this first of all uh, you will take the parents you you know blood group uh, a blood group and b blood group so this first condition we have this then from the gametes after the gamete formation in the upper generation you can see both the alleles first is the ia and second is the ib is present okay so here it produce the phenotype of ab blood group this is because of the co dominance so this ia allele cannot mask the action of this and ib cannot mask the action of this they both are independent they do not mix but they are independent so the blood group is not a not b it is ab okay and after this do we you will do this selfing selfing after the selfing you know the selfing means the genotypes of both are same and from the gametes and from the checkerboard and in up to generation you will see that the phenotype ratio is deviated from 3 is to 1 that is for the mendel's monohybrid cross it is 1 is to 2 is to 1 genotype is same but phenotype is changed so this is because of the co dominance in the incomplete dominance it is also 1 is to 2 is to 1 but is it is different from the co dominance because in incomplete dominance they both the alleles mix in each other pink color produced but here this the a b blood group not mix in each other they both are independent alleles okay okay so this is the formula to know the number of genotypes directly okay in the short time this is the number of genotypes is equal to the n n plus 1 upon 2 okay where n means the number of different alleles at a locus on the same locus different alleles are present that is known as the n okay so the n number of allele for the haploid cell 
or can eat like a sperm or ovum is one for diploid cell two blood group three alleles you know the multiple alleles in three types of and uh, the rubber the rabbit coat color have the four alleles which are present on the same locus or locus okay which are from for a single gene okay okay this is for single gene this is for for from a single gene okay so so this for the diploid cell for the diploid cell you know two number of alleles are two so uh, if we put this for number in the formula then the genotype is three types of genotypes are produced so if you take the examples of mendel's monohybrid cross in which the three types of genotypes are produced uh, first is this phenotypically tall homozygous phenotypically tall but heterozygous in this and phenotypically dwarf n and homozygous so we can directly know the number not exactly the structure of this genotypes but directly in the short time we can know the number of the genotypes by this formula okay and uh, the blood group three alleles are present so six types of genotypes are produced and the structure of the genotypes are is this okay you know that so by this formula we can know the number of genotypes that how many genotypes are formed for this in short time okay but for the structure we should use this method but short time in a numerical you can use to uh, know the number easily okay and i hope you understood and stay tuned for the next videos and if you like the videos press the like button and share it and don't forget to subscribe my channel asmas botany and press the bell icon for the latest update thank you